What's going on, YouTube? It's Legion Eleven. I was um, I was listening to uh, it was the second part to the Sim Heads United versus the Sim Standard. I'm gonna check the third one out uh, in a minute. I started watching it, but you know, I'm gonna check that out in a minute, man. But um, shout out to put him in the game. He don't know it, but that's my nigga, man. Shout out to Apex, man. Matter of fact, shouts to all my niggas, man. Sim Heads, man. Um. But yeah, I was checking that video, man, and um, I seen that he was trying to he was trying to make a valid point. He was trying to I'm not gonna say help them out, but he was trying to give them uh, a better understanding of why um certain things happen or certain things are said, you know, from certain people by certain people. And um, <clears throat> it seemed to me as though they didn't really they didn't really care, you know, they don't care about pretty much they don't care about the things that got them where they are you know I guess they reach a certain point that they're comfortable on they feel like they're untouchable <clears throat> but um they're not you know I'm not gonna put no energy into bringing them down although you know I'm not gonna do it it's not it's not important to me right now you know, but um, what what is important to me and what has been important to me for years is the EA and the the license deal that they made. Um, the the monopolizing of the football games, the football genre, the NFL, um, football games. Um, I'm sorry, the NFL football video games. Uh, I don't remember the names, but um. Dude tried to make a point. The point that he tried to make, he used um, well, Burger King. Hey, let's say you work at uh, McDonald's. I'm, I'm just, I'm not saying you work at McDonald's. This one give you a hypothetical. Say you work at McDonald's, okay? Now you know at McDonald's you have your job. You know you have a manager, and then you have know you have a, a owner. And then you have a CEO in a corporation. I mean, you know there's a marketing team. There's a there's a a, a level of all that, right? Can you, can we agree on that? Yeah. I, I, okay. Yeah. So, if you're working at Burger King and I come to you and say, "Man, I don't like the Whopper, man. I, man, why, why can't they add like jalapenos on a Whopper, man? Can Can you go and, and and look out for me? Go go get the jalapenos on the Whopper, okay? And what you do is like, okay, you know what, man? I you know since I work here, I do have a voice, and I'm gonna go wow. to whoever I can go to, and I'm gonna tell them. So you go tell the manager, it might get up to the owner, but it might stop at marketing. But then I can't blame you if I don't have any jalapenos on my Whopper because I know that as long as you're listening and you're doing something, you see what I'm saying? Right, but the end, at the end of the day, you still want jalapenos on your Whopper. So. Exactly, right. But you're absolutely right, but what, I, all I can keep doing is keep trying to push and push. Not exactly the same thing. Um not exactly the same thing at all actually but the ideal could be the same um how how this works is that if the person that he went to if the employee that he went to felt the same way then those two could make a difference they can start making a difference from that point if they if they believed in it that much oh they can make a difference you know period um, the idea is business, product, consumer. Put them in the game with saying that the, the consumer is the boss. And the reaction from him saying that was a disagreement or a denial. In other words, they didn't feel like the customer or the consumer is the boss. The customer is the boss. Well, the customer is not the boss. Because, yeah, it, the customer it, it, when, when, when it comes to marketing one hundred and one, the customer the, the customer has a say. But if you look at the larger scheme of things, it's the marketing company or wow. uh, the marketings that that say what y'all going to take. You know, Nike was like, you know what, we're going to put out a red colored shoe, and I don't care if you like it or not. You either going to buy it or not, and you can't complain about it because. We don't exactly. care. Not exactly. saying they, not saying that EA doesn't care. I'm just saying as far as like Nike concerned. Okay, I'm gonna tell you why that's not true. 
and I'm saying it as fact. This is not opinion. All right. Now, the ideal of saying the customer is the boss, that can be disputed, just like the customer is always right. That can be disputed. But <clears throat> that's if you take it literally. You know what I'm saying? The customer is always right is not a literal. It's not a literal term. You know what I'm saying? It's not literal. It just means that the customer is a priority. And damn well they are. We are. Let me help y'all understand the difference between a consumer and a customer. Okay? There is a difference. It's a slight difference. Not really important. Not too important. But it's a slight difference. The difference between a customer and a consumer. A customer is the person or the people um, that buys the product. Okay? The consumer is the person or the people that uses the product and most likely on a regular basis or whatever you know scratch that the consumer is the motherfucker that uses the product the consumer uses the product okay cool so at any given time a consumer can become a customer simply by buying a product not that important you know so in other words if i became a customer and i bought soap okay and <clears throat> Somebody else liked the soap, and I was like, you know what? I'll get you one too. I gave them, I bought them a soap, gave it to them, and they use it. Okay, they're consumer. Right, big fucking deal. Anyway, <clears throat> um, that's the difference between a customer and a, and a consumer. <clears throat> Back to what I was saying. For for any business, and I do mean any business selling anything or doing anything, needs a customer. Um. <clears throat> Most businesses focus their entire their entire business or their entire business plan based off of the the customer. Here's how that works. All right, the cust the, the business is created based off of what the customer wants. Um, maybe consumer demand. All right. <clears throat> oh, so person people becomes a business, and they formulate their business off of that ideal of what the, the customers needs. Once that's done, it doesn't stop there because it has to continue. So they create it, they put it out there. Once a person becomes a customer, they then become a promoter for that that product and that that company. This is how a business then gets more customers, you know, from you know consumers. And the better the product, the more customers, the more money. All right. Is the customer the boss? Yes, the customer is the boss. Why is the customer the boss? Okay, because if the business doesn't get any customers, they don't get any sales, and they don't get any profit. So that means there's no what? Anybody. Anybody. Exactly. Right, that's right. You're exactly right. There's no business, and how a business survives basically is it's based on um how well they sell their product better than their competition. How can one one customer, one unsatisfied customer or consumer, take a stance against an entire business? There's he says that the community the community isn't big enough to compete with them. Alright, that's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. Because, I'm going to say this right here. The reason why it's bullshit, because if he didn't feel like the community wasn't large enough to make a difference, there wouldn't have been a community to begin with. He wouldn't be a part of what we know as the Sim Standard. Alright? So, that's bullshit. And they're just not, to me, they're not being honest about what their purpose is or what their purpose has become and it's fine you know it's fine but they still hold the name the sim standard and the standard isn't being upheld but that's been said a hundred million motherfucking times and hadn't mattered to them yet all right so never mind that the community is 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 definitely large enough to compete the what 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 we don't have enough of is community support um 
See, the ideal is, or what I mean by that is, you have the Sim Heads United, which is actually holding the standard or defending the standard of, of simulation football video games. Okay, then you have the Sim Standard, right? Now, if the Sim Standard and Sim Heads United were to come together with the same cause, right? That doesn't even, that sounds like an oxymoron. That sounds like, okay, you got the Sim Standard and then you got Sim Heads United. Alright, anyway, <clears throat> if they was to come together, fuck it, if they was to come together and speak on the same cause, that just don't sound like saying that shit. Okay. That shit really doesn't sound... Alright, anyway, if they was to come together all right, and speak on the same cause against the same company, okay, that would make a hell of a difference. I'm going to tell you why. You already know why, but I'm going to tell you why. Because it's like the, the the snowball effect, right? You know, you already have, you got certain people that's following um, the Sim Heads United, and then you have a certain amount of people that's following um, the Sim Standard. Um, <clears throat> regardless of how many there are, it's still enough people. One person is enough to, to start a movement. One person is enough to... You know, to, to make a stance. Really. If they come together and draw the attention of other people who may feel the same way or help people realize what they've been feeling, um, then they'll become a part of the community and speak out as well. Now, what we don't have, and I said we, is a strategy of how to go about it um we've tried we've tried different things i mean i've tried i've tried a couple things i've even tried going to look first of all before i say this i know it's a game but it's the principle in it all right it's the principle all right first of all it's not just a game to me all right because for one, I used to buy these games, but now I don't, and I'm being cheated because I don't. I want to play a football game because I grew up playing them, and there's never been a problem then. But now, all of a sudden, nobody's making any football games except one company, and the company that's making the football games isn't making the football games at the standard that they they have, that they should, and that they probably could. And most importantly, they're not giving anyone else a chance to do that. All right, so it's it's. It's far beyond it being just a game. Okay? Um, there's principles in it. You know, um, and I've even went to as far as writing a letter to the President of the United States concerning this matter. And <clears throat> from my understanding, the, the letters that I write don't go straight to him. Cool. I didn't decide, I didn't put that up on I didn't want to put that on on uh, on YouTube you know just because of of who I was sending it to you know that and I didn't want to do that I feel like that would have been bringing out it, it kind of would have changed the 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 idea or, or the idea of you know what I was doing you know at least in my head at least in my head And I mean, we can't we can't go go at them about the monopoly, but we can go at them about quality and warranty. See, because that's something else about businesses. Businesses have to produce products at at quality at a quality standard. Um, and if they don't, then they're entitled to a refund. They're entitled to a refund, some kind of reimbursement. All right. Um. That's that's just that's just the business law, and I'm uh, um, I'm also gonna give y'all a link, um, you know, to, to to you know to give y'all a better idea of business law. You know, it's a, um that's that's something else that businesses you know have to do, and um, EA has not been producing anything to that to at, at quality standard.
So we are we as the customer or the consumer have have the power to 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 bankrupt or shut down or prevent or stop or end any business, you know, <clears throat> because we are what makes the business. Period. Point blank. Um, I don't care who tells you differently. They they bullshit me. Like real talk. I mean that's like that's easy math. You ain't good at math. You science. You know it, it gives you the same answer. You know what I mean? And the problem that I see, the problem that's been, that the, the problem that, that, that has become now is, it's us, us versus us, rather. Sound like some real nigga shit, though. But it's us versus us. And because of that, it's like we're losing, you know, we're, we're splitting our community in two, two parts. When really, everybody wants a good football game. You know? Or more football games you know whatever i mean we just want we all want the same thing i don't get it maybe maybe that's the problem maybe that's the problem maybe because we, we all want the same thing you know it doesn't make sense but that could be it you know you know and some people are willing to go a certain way to get it and some people are willing to go a different way to get it you know what i mean and or some people just ain't willing to to, to do nothing just wishing you know, but that's that's part of life, man. But um, I'm gonna give y'all the link so y'all can research this shit yourselves. Get get more educated on on how things you know should be, you know, and how things can be, and how we can make a difference and all that. Now I'm, I seriously doubt that um it's gonna make a difference with arrogance, which is a form of ignorance. Um, <clears throat> but you know, never know. People change. People change. Um, another thing, man, I've said this to them before. So I'm, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say it again. I'm going to say this on camera. Sim Heads United, we should do our own thing. You know, let them do them and we do our own thing. I mean, for me, it's been a year. And these niggas ain't, these niggas ain't doing it. So let them do them. Like, put too much energy on trying to help them understand themselves. You know, that's we have no control over that. And we're going to drive ourselves crazy. Trying to, like, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Let's do us. Let's do things our way. We got, we can help each other out. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we all want to have to go in it together. You know what I mean? And, and, and make shit happen. You know, come together, create these ideas for this one cause. You know, and let that be that, and just make sure that it stands up to, to the standard. You know that that it's supposed to stand up to. You know, and another thing is the idea of, you know, what I'm gonna have to find. I'm gonna have to find the definition of um, simulation, um, and, and I'm gonna give y'all a link to that too. EA has to have customers, consumers, period, period. There is no business that can survive without a customer or a consumer. <clears throat> no business can survive without a customer, all right? Um, matter of fact, the whole, the, the way a business gets started is due to the customer. The way a business continues to be a business and a successful business is due to the customer all right so the customer is the boss all right disagree all you want and the reason why I would think that someone would disagree with that is probably because they they don't quite understand the they don't quite understand how how a business works or they don't understand their, their power or their role as a customer and that's fine because now if you're um if you're viewing this now you do so now there's no reason for you to deny the saying or the term or the figure of speech or whatever you want to call it the customer is the boss or the customer is always right now you have a better understanding of what it means all right so now you don't have to deny that cool all right. 